Hey there guys, it's Green47. Um, as you can see here, I saved four times in the last episode. Just in case I end up having a recording failure, or I don't think my commentary is perfect, then I can go back and redo it. So, with that said, let's get on to the episode. Um, I believe this episode will have two new enemies, it might have three. Which will all get bios. And we have a boss fight. Um, does this do anything? No, it's just a picture. Anyway. Let's talk to Leon. Let's talk to Yuffie. We opened the treasure chest? I thought we did. Oh, here we go. Guess what? What? Where do you want me to go, Leon? Come on. Talking to you is supposed to... Okay, here we go. Sooner or later, the Heartless will find us. We should probably prepare ourselves. Um, yeah, I'm, I'm ready to fight for my life. Let's go join Aerith, who is with the other visitors. Yuffie, go! Yuffie! Sora, let's go! <laughs> Alright, yeah, we should find the leader. But first, this is an enemy bio. These are soldiers. Um, you should remember how the bios worked from last episode in which the first bio was introduced. That level up was just the greatest thing, because obviously we have to go fight the leader. I do want to get some experience from these guys. Um, I'm not planning on max leveling in this run. Max level being 99, but I definitely am planning on getting level somewhere between 50 to 70, because of all the bonus stuff that we'll be doing, and the, um, the secret bosses and whatnot. I'm going to need to be, <laughs> I'm going to need to be very high for some of the secret bosses, and heck, the game in general. It's not an easy game. Ooh, Spirit Shard, that's nice. We'll go over drop items later. There's a potion, um, two potions. I think I have one in my stock, two in my stock. Um, we're actually going to put that there, put that there. You do have to manually set items. I don't use items too much later on. Spirit Shard and a Mithril Shard. We're going to need both of those, that's good. Um, yeah, I'm going to need those things. Anyway, let's head out into 2nd District. And... Dang, time's flying already. Let's fight some more. I'm just gonna fight some more of the small guys before we go fight the boss. I'd like to level up one more time. Unfortunately, I didn't look to see how much more experience we need. That's a thing I should have thought about. But I just didn't. Didn't think it would be necessary. I'll take out this guy. You can't open the menu. Um, the, the, the object tree, that's not what it's called. The tree down at the bottom left, it's not a literal tree. The command tree, that's what it is. Um, when that is red, you cannot pause, uh, status. Ooh, 58 experience, that's a lot. Don't think we'll be getting that before the boss. Um, we will be doing some more, a few more enemies, though. We'll take them out. Oh, that was close. Luckily I blocked it. I can't wait to get an actual block command. We'll get that relatively soon. Um, yeah, 58 experience is more than I'm willing to get, so let's head off into third- I- I can't roll, either. Let's head off into third district, and fight the boss. Guys, let's go get him!
Alright, obviously, you can't fight the boss until we dispatch a few more small guys. So, let's take them out. Um, we have new party members. They are Donald and Goofy. Um, I'm going to assume you're familiar with them because they're pretty universal characters. Oh, I'm gonna shut up now. This is Guard Armor, the boss. Um, enemy bio will be on screen for 15 seconds. He is... Um, he's a relatively difficult boss. I'd actually like to go get this money real quick. Before before even thinking about fighting Guard Armor. Alright, okay. That didn't do what I thought. So yes, Donald and Goofy. Um, my assumption is that you're familiar with those characters. Both very iconic Disney characters. Um, I'm taking damage like crazy. Donald being our magician healer guy, um, I think right now he has like, fire, thunder, blizzard, and cure. Uh, all classic Final Fantasy attacks. Obviously this game is made by Square Enix, who also made Final Fantasy. I need a potion. Alright, now his feet are separate. He can do this from time to time. Um, when this happens, he is going to attack like crazy, and you basically want to stay away from the hands at all costs. The feet are what I always go for first, because they have very high defense, and very high HP, and they drop lots of HP. When you break the feet, you do... Ah, 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 nah, 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 nah. He's gonna attack. Alright, I... He's going to do his spin. You wanna get away when he does, does the spin. And yeah, this is an original boss. He's... Um, hopefully it's obvious. He's not based off of any, like, Disney characters. We will get bosses later on that are based off of Disney characters. Ow. But we won't have any for quite some time. Actually, we'll, we'll get one in, like, three episodes, I think. This being episode five, we will get one by episode eight. No, we won't. No, we won't. That's an original boss, too. I'm stupid. Okay, um... I need health. Luckily, uh, I just broke a foot, and there's HP just all over the battlefield. You do want to take apart the parts first. That went well. He will still do the spin attack with one hand. It does less damage. Um, has a smaller defer. I think it does the same amount of damage. It hits you uh, half the amount of times. Let's take care of him. Um, oh, I never explained what Goofy does. Goofy obviously has that shield. He negates a lot of physical attacks. Um, he's relatively weak to magic. Magic is not something that he's good with. I like it. Oh, this is the guy's body attack. When you get him down to just the body, he does his little tornado. It's not bad. Uh, Donald is dead. I can revive him by giving him a potion or something. But luckily for me, that was unnecessary. Goofy has many attacks that involve the shield, and I'm going to have to shut up now. So, you were looking for me? Uh -huh. They too have been seeking the wielder of the Keyblade. Hey, why don't you come with us? We can go to other worlds on our vessel. I wonder if I could find Riku and Kairi. Of course! Are you sure? Who knows? But we need them to come with us to help us find the king. Sora, go with them. Especially if you want to find your friends. Yeah, I guess. But you can't come along looking like that. Understand? Ooh. No problem. No sad friends. Okay? Yeah, you gotta look funny. Like us. <laughs> Whoa. 
Yes, but ones like happy faces. Happy? Okay, why not? I'll go with you guys. Double duck! Name's Goofy. I'm Sora. All for one, one for all. Squirt took down that heartless. Who'd have thought it? Such is the power of the Keyblade. The child's strength is not his own. Why don't we turn him into a heartless? <laughs> That'll settle things quick enough. And the black friends of the king's lackeys. Swung on the ice, they're all built tracks by the look of them. You're no prize yourself. <laughs> Shut up! Enough! The Keyblade has chosen him. Will it be he who conquers the darkness? Or will the darkness swallow him? Either way, he could be quite useful. Oh yeah, free money. All right. Um, that was quite the interesting cutscene there. I forget what it's called when the main characters don't know something, but the audience does. Um, there's some actual term for that, but irrelevant. That happened. We can go to the gummy ship from save points or from actually exiting the world through a world exit. Not every world has a world exit. Yes, magic. So we have fire now. And Goofy is going to give us Dodge Roll. That's an ability that I want. So, before we get going... Oh, yeah, and Jiminy Cricket. He'll be keeping track of the adventure. Alright, before we get going... Um, you may have seen, at the end of that fight, we got a Brave Warrior. That boosts our strength by 1 and our HP by 3. We're going to be getting that... Um, Donald and Goofy have nothing, they have, like, default weapons and stuff. Um, I will be giving the potions, one to Donald, and one to Goofy. We'll also be, um, customizing Donald and Goofy right now. You can manually change their AI to work the way you want it to go. Um, I want defensive magic and HP items to be... I think that's about how I want him to go, actually. Yeah, that's good. And Goofy, you want... Yes. Immediately, um, support actions constantly, shield techniques, special attacks, and regular attacks. That's about how I want my two AI characters to go. Um, you're more than welcome to change them however you want. However, if you're following along with this walkthrough, uh, these are the way that we'll be going. We also got the ability Dodge Roll. We're going to equip that, and we can roll. Um, Goofy has Rocket. He jumps up, and hits the guy in the air with his shield. This makes him much more useful, as he can now attack aerial enemies. Donald is level 6, Goofy is level 9, we are level 7. You can see their stats down in the bottom right. Um, in the journal, you can look a bit about the story, and you can see characters that we've met so far which is a lot more than you think. Um, characters 2 and the enemies. We've seen these. I didn't do a bio on Darkseid. I don't plan on doing a bio on Darkseid because he's not that important. He's just kind of a tutorial boss. Um, can roll around and this is a thing. So there are these marks all, all across the ground called Trinities. Um, you can do a Trinity 
when you are next to a Trinity Mark. They're simple. And blue ones, you just kind of jump, and things happen. So we have been teleported up here somewhere I did not plan on going, but I wanted to show off the Trinities. So we got a postcard. I wasn't planning on getting all the postcards, but we might as well now. Um, we cannot do the stuff that's supposed to be done over here yet, I don't think. I'm not actually sure. I don't think we can, but nonetheless, it's worth a shot. Yeah, we have to... We, we can work with that later. Um, there are ten postcards throughout Traverse Town. When you put one in, you get something out. We got a cottage here. We can use that. It's an item we can use from the menu. We'll worry about that later. There's one more postcard I want to get real quick. Um, just because I know where it is off the top of my head. I had I will be getting the rest of them later on in the LP. Not right now. But there's a postcard right there. That's the easiest one. That's the one that everyone knows about. So yeah, that's the thing I just wanted to grab real quick, and we'll mail that. I believe we get a tent for the second one. Oh, a Mithril Shard! Well, that's good. Alright, Final Fantasy characters over there, Yuffie, Leon, Aerith, formerly known as Yuffie, Squall, and Eris. Um, they changed some names in Kingdom Hearts. I'm not 100% sure why. I mean, they give some reasons, but it feels like they could have gone with the originals. Anyway, let's go out to the world exit. This episode has gone on longer than I would have liked it to go on. But we got a lot done. This is the world map. We can... yeah, they're telling me things. Um, don't need you to talk. So we can go to these worlds. Both of them. This one has a battle level of one star and we don't know the name. This one has a battle level of two stars, and we don't know the name. We will be going to the top one first, but we'll head off in the next episode. So thank you guys for watching. I had a great time. I hope you did. Um, leave a like or a comment down below. It means a lot to me. Um, make sure to follow me on Twitter to keep up with everything I'm doing and know what videos are getting uploaded when. Um, I think that's about it. I'll see you guys next time.